Okay, so let's talk a little bit about mass versus weight. So most people do not think that these are different things, but in science, yes, they are different. Mass is um, the measurement of the amount of matter in an object, okay? So how much matter matters, anything that has mass takes up space. So how much of that is in an object? It can only be found by comparing the object on a scale to an object of a known mass on a scale. Wherever the mass is measured, it remains constant. So mass never changes. You're the same mass here as next door as on the moon. Now weight is actually measured in Newtons and we know that Newtons are force, right? So it's actually a measure of the gravitational force on an object. So weight is gonna be affected by the gravitational force present, not necessarily um, the mass. So if you are on the moon versus on the earth, your mass will be the same, but your weights will be different because the moon and the earth have different gravitational forces. All right, so in order to calculate our weight, we're gonna use good old trusty, uh, good old trusty F equal MA, um, second law of motion. So basically we've got force due to gravity or weight equals the mass of the object. So what's really important is that it's in kilograms um, times the acceleration due to gravity, which is negative 10 meters per second squared or negative 9.8 if you wanna get super technical. All right, so let's look at a couple practice problems. So um, what is the mass of an object weighing 90 newtons on Earth? So remember that everything's coming back to our little F equal MA. So we got 90 equals, we don't know the mass, and the um, acceleration due to gravity on Earth is negative 10. Okay, and technically um, the weight or the force due to gravity is negative 90 because directionally it's going the same direction. So if you solve this, you would see that your mass is nine kilograms. All right, on Earth, what is the weight of a seven kilogram object? So again, if we're gonna do F equal MA, um, our M is seven kilograms, our A is negative 10 meters per second squared. So that means that the weight on Earth is negative 70 newtons. All right, and then last but not least, what is the weight of a 14 kilogram box on the moon if acceleration due to gravity on the moon is 13, I mean, not 13, 3.7 meters per second squared? So we've got our F equal MA equation. We know that we have a 14 kilogram box and it's going at 3.7 meters per second squared. Technically it's a negative because it is going down. So that means that our weight on the moon is 51.8 newtons. And directionally, technically it's negative because it's going down. <laughs>